All right. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Brian from KHUX Nation. And in today's video, we're going to be discussing on how to be Envy in the new uh, Keyblade War Part 3. Okay. Now, to be honest, Envy's probably... Envy is probably one of the uh, easiest out of all the four tellers at the moment. Uh, although... Yeah, she's just the easiest, okay? You don't, and just to point out here right as well, you don't need nearly as much OP stuff as I have, in my opinion, in order to be Envy, okay? Um, compared to a said who, like, I was able to barely beat, Envy is way more forgiving, and you could probably be able to get past her a lot easier with a lot uh, less OP metal, okay? So... The only I, I'll quickly go through things real quick. Okay, now, just like with the said, all of my metals have extra attack, uh, except my Kinemarch Two Sword and Riku. Okay, um, the only thing worth noting about this, the only reason this metal is here, is because of the fact that it has the 100% paralysis resist trait. That is literally the only reason why I have this metal. Okay, this metal doesn't even do any damage or much damage at all. Uh, because of the fact it's on the reverse slot on my sleeping lion so it's literally there just for the paralysis resist okay um and then for the rest is just damage so for envy envy is is a little different okay and the only thing you have to worry about for in regards to envy is the fact that she counterattacks on after slot two okay and the fact that b she inflicts paralysis whenever she counterattacks. Okay, so those are the, those are the two big things you need to keep in mind. Um, the paralysis is a big thing though that you need to try and avoid. So you want to try and pick middles as much as possible that resist paralysis at all costs. Okay, preferably a metal that has 100% paralysis resist. Okay, that's your best chance. So without further ado, we'll quickly get started. All right, it's honestly not that complicated. You can quite honestly just grab your strongest metals and fight envy as long as you have that paralysis resist you should be golden okay so first of all we'll start off with Kyrie. we'll overwrite her max deep uh defenses so she no longer has them and then i'll go ahead and use i don't know i'll use gula here for the big buffs for the speed metal buffs okay now i'll just go ahead and run through my setup now the cool thing about Envy is the fact she introduces a new mechanic into the game, which we might start seeing now uh, in future boss battles, okay? Um, and I, personally, I like this a lot just because I think it finally brings a little bit more of like a strategic aspect back into the game, okay? Whereas for Envy, she says she counterattacks after, after slot 2, okay? But it's after each cast of slot 2. It's not after you're done with slot two before slot three. Okay, so like here, for example, my Ventus is extra attack. I'm gonna go ahead and cast him once. Hit her, she counterattacks. Okay, if I use him again, she still counterattacks. Okay, so that's that's new, that's different, and that's interesting. Um, you will live through it. The primary thing, like I mentioned before, is you have the paralysis resist. Otherwise, each time she hits you, she has a chance to paralyze you. If you don't have any resist at all whatsoever, you are guaranteed going to be paralyzed. And that paralyze can mess you up and making you skip some of your medals later in your setup. So you want to make sure you absolutely have to have paralysis if it's possible. Um, from here on out though, you can pretty much just go nuts. Just let your setup run through his course. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Like, as long as you don't have the paralysis, you're, you're pretty much fine. You don't have to worry about anything. Alright. Go ahead and use... Get that 280% guilt buff. I'll lift through the counterattacks, which is fine. All 
Right, and now I'll get ready for the same thing. And there you go, you beat MV. Again, I don't think you actually need nearly as OP of metals as I do in order to beat MV. This is just what I happen to use, okay? As you can see, there's not nearly as much like restrictions towards fighting EV compared to there was as said. So if you uh, don't have nearly as OP metals such as me, don't worry. You should have a lot easier time with MV compared to as said, okay? Um, my medals had most of my medals had extra attack and minus 60 although i don't think you need both of them to do it you want to when fighting the foretellers i do recommend highly recommend you have at least minus 60 on your medals in order to do at least some bit of damage to them um but i don't i don't think you need the extra attack on everything in order to get past this nor do i think you even need the uh this the metal strength buffs in order to get past uh mv either so just throwing that out there she does seem to alternate, uh, kind of like how a said does, though, and between doing a small attack and a big attack. So that's worth noting. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. As long as you have the paralysis resist, you should be, and you can run your strongest setup, you should be pretty much good. So, without further ado, uh, if you enjoyed the, uh, go ahead and let me know what your thoughts and opinions are about Envy in the comment section down below. If you have any particular setups or advice you might want to offer to other players. Go ahead and let that be known in the comment section as well but if you enjoyed the video or, or found it helpful please leave a like subscribe and hit that bell button it's the best way i know when i upload more videos like this one my name is brian from k hux nation i'll see you guys in the next video probably in a couple minutes or an hour or something see you guys